I'm scared. I really didn't want to do this. What the hell? They lying. This girl broken. It's time to get serious. Time to get ready to go box. So let's go. Rocky, how are you feeling? Scared. You should be. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Quick, quick, quick. One, two. Boom. Okay. Ha, right back. Hold it, ha. hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Come from here, oh. hands on the ground, you're no, gonna come man. out. See what we got here. Okay, I've been doing my thing for about three weeks and especially just being really consistent with my cardio. So right now, I feel like I lost interest for sure, especially my waistline. I'm terrified to get on the scale because I don't want to be discouraged. It's time to get on that scale, scary cat. Pushing myself during this journey is way, way harder than I thought. It's my mind, I can do it. I, I can tell myself to do anything, but getting up and doing it is a different story. The schedule that I have with my son and my businesses and everything that I have to do, it's so hard to get up and actually initiate. In the industry that I'm in right now, you have to be what's popping. I'm so scared. I'm scared. I really didn't want to do this. And I got clothes on, so let's make sure that, and I got three pounds of hair. So I'm going to have to take at least four, five pounds off of me. Okay. That's another pound that I just gained. Look that line. This scale broken. Oh, it's this. Hold on. It's on kilograms. Oh God, it's on pounds now. Oh my God, I'm happy! Oh <laughs> I did lose, I lost like 10 pounds, I lost 11 pounds. I'm officially 298 pounds, so that means that I lost like 11 to 12 pounds. That's really good. The fact that I got on it and I actually lost weight, I can't even explain how I felt because I thought I was losing weight and I get on the scale, two, three, four, five pounds heavier. And it just really broke me down as a person. I thought I was gonna cry. Woo! <sighs> okay, so, but now it's time to get ready to go box. It's time to get serious, let's go. Today I'm meeting with John Matos. He's a boxing and training coach. I heard a lot about John. I've seen some of the stuff that he's been doing. He's really good. That's why I reached out to him and I'm kind of a little nervous because I know he goes hard. Hi. Hey, Hello. how are you? Uh, I'm good, are you John? Yes, Rocky? Yes. Nice to meet you, how are you feeling? Scared. Uh, you should be. Hopefully today is not too intense, but at the same time, that's what I need. All right, so come here real quick. Let me ask you a few questions before we get started. So tell me a little bit about yourself. Any workout experience, any past injuries? Fitness-wise, I was on an expert level, okay. competition, Good. doing all kind of stuff. I'm expecting a lot then. No, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Please no, John. Um, when COVID hit, it was like, you know, what's a couple weeks, what's two, three weeks out the gyms? And then it turned into, are we even surviving this? And <laughs> yeah. then everybody got into apocalypse mode. Yeah. It went from a couple months to a whole year and a half, no gym. Where do you want to be at? Where do you see yourself a couple months from now, weight-wise, physique-wise, okay. okay. health-wise, more importantly? Honestly, I realized I need help. Okay. I need a coach. To me, 250 is my goal. So today what we're gonna do is, okay. I'm pretty much throwing you in the fire. No, no, I no, need no. to see where you're <laughs> So we're gonna start with a nice easy warm up. Okay. It's three rounds. Each round is gonna gradually get stronger, faster, and more intense. It's all the way up, all the way down. Uh-huh, hit it, hit it. Five. If I can really like pull through the workout and finish, or at least, I don't wanna say impress him, but impress myself, it's gonna do a lot for my system. There you go. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. You're gonna come from here, hands on the ground, you're no, gonna come man. out. You got Damn. this. Ready? Okay. Yes. So we're gonna bring those knees all the way in. Keep that core tight. Keep that fast. Everything's jiggling. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. So now we're gonna go into boxing. You ever boxed before? No. Careful with the nails. Oh, snap. Hold on. So let's do it. Good. You got good speed. Do I? Yeah, you actually do. <laughs> you got good speed. Ha, right back. Ha, right back. Ha, 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 ha. One more. Ha, ha, good. Ha, one. One, two. Ha, ha, there you go. Two and counter. One, two. Counter, boom. Last 
Last combination we're gonna do a one, two, three, two. One, two, three, two. Hold on. One, two, three, two. Uh huh. Last one. Hard. Come on. Good. <laughs> we went easy, just so you know. No, we didn't. It's gonna get harder gradually, but. You did it, you made it happen. I feel so good. Honestly though, you did really good. The boxing, you said it was your first time boxing and you look pretty natural. I would recommend we start working out at least three times a week. Okay. And then the days that I don't see you, I'm giving you homework to do. Sometimes, honestly, you just need someone on your Right. After completing this workout, I feel extremely motivated. Like, I'm gonna hire John. I'm gonna work out with John three times a week. I was sweating profusely. Like, I needed water, I thought I was gonna die. I feel like I could accomplish anything at this point. He even told me a couple times that I did really good. I know I have a lot of strength and proper formation. That's the thing. So the fact that I was able to achieve what he told me to do, get it done, and he was actually impressed, I was impressed. Sometimes I think I, I don't got it, but I do. I, my strength is still there. <laughs>